Family conflicts arise in every household, but knowing how to deal with them constructively is essential. Instead of letting emotions take over, it's important to approach the situation calmly. Identifying the root cause of the conflict is crucial in resolving it. Ignoring or suppressing issues can lead to bigger problems, making open communication key to maintaining strong family relationships and fostering an understanding of each other. A lack of communication is one of the leading causes of family conflicts. Misunderstandings can quickly arise when family members don't express their thoughts and feelings clearly. This creates room for assumptions and builds up resentment. To avoid this, it is important to establish an open and respectful dialogue where everyone feels heard. Active listening, without interruptions, is key to resolving misunderstandings effectively. Another critical aspect of resolving family conflicts is showing empathy. Each person's feelings and perspective are valid, even if they differ from your own. By putting yourself in someone else's shoes, you can better understand their point of view and come up with solutions that work for everyone. Empathy builds trust within the family, promoting unity and helping to ease tensions that may arise from disagreements. Compromise is often necessary in conflict resolution. Family members may not always get exactly what they want, but finding middle ground is essential. Compromise shows a willingness to cooperate and find solutions that benefit the entire family, rather than focusing on individual desires. This approach helps prevent resentment and encourages a cooperative mindset where everyone feels valued and respected. Setting clear boundaries during disagreements can also prevent conflicts from escalating. Sometimes, family members may say hurtful things in the heat of the moment. By agreeing to respect each other and avoid raising voices or using offensive language, a safer environment for resolving issues is created. Boundaries help maintain respectful communication, which is the foundation of any healthy family dynamic. It's also important to take breaks when emotions are running high. Stepping away from an argument allows everyone to cool down and reflect on the situation. This doesn't mean avoiding the conflict, but giving space to approach it with a calmer mindset. Once emotions are under control, the conversation can resume with the focus on finding solutions rather than further escalating the disagreement. Seeking professional help is another option when family conflicts become too difficult to resolve internally. Therapists or family counselors can offer an unbiased perspective and provide tools for healthier communication. In some cases, family dynamics are complex, and outside help is necessary to guide the family toward better conflict resolution strategies. A third-party mediator can also help facilitate discussions. Forgiveness plays a vital role in resolving long-standing conflicts within families. Holding on to past mistakes or grudges can prevent healing and growth. Forgiving doesn't mean forgetting, but rather releasing negative feelings and focusing on restoring relationships. By fostering forgiveness, family members can rebuild trust and strengthen their bonds. It's an essential step in moving forward and ensuring that past conflicts don't continue to cause tension. Family conflicts aren't always caused by personal issues, external stressors like financial difficulties or work-related problems can also lead to disagreements. Recognizing that stress from outside factors can affect family dynamics helps shift the focus from blame to collective problem-solving. When family members address external stressors together, they strengthen their relationships by working as a team. Parenting styles are another common source of conflict in families, especially between partners. One parent may prefer a more strict approach, while the other might take a more relaxed stance. These differences can create tension, especially when it comes to decision-making regarding children. It's important for parents to communicate privately and reach a consensus, ensuring consistency and avoiding sending mixed messages to their children. Sibling rivalry is another frequent source of family tension. When children feel like they have to compete for attention or affection, it can lead to jealousy and arguments. Parents can help mitigate this by fostering cooperation among siblings and avoiding favoritism. 
Encouraging open dialogue, setting rules, and teaching conflict resolution skills are effective ways to reduce rivalry and promote harmonious relationships between siblings. Conflicts can also arise from extended family members, particularly when cultural differences or generational gaps come into play. Balancing the expectations of older relatives with more modern views can be challenging. However, it's important to find common ground and maintain respectful communication to preserve family harmony. Navigating these differences with patience and understanding can lead to a stronger, more unified family. Financial disagreements are often a major source of conflict within families. Whether it's due to differing opinions on budgeting or financial priorities, money matters can create significant stress. To avoid these conflicts, families should discuss finances openly and create a clear plan that everyone agrees on. This transparency helps set expectations and reduces the likelihood of arguments over financial decisions. Unrealistic expectations within families can also lead to disappointment and conflict. Whether parents place too much pressure on their children or partners expect too much from each other, unmet expectations can cause tension. Open communication and setting realistic, achievable goals are key to managing expectations. By understanding and accepting each other's limitations, family members can avoid unnecessary conflicts. Teaching children conflict resolution skills from an early age can help prevent future family disputes. By modeling positive behaviors and guiding them through disagreements, parents can equip their children with the tools needed to handle conflicts constructively. These skills will not only benefit them within the family but also in their future relationships and social interactions. Humor can be a helpful tool in diffusing tense situations. Sometimes, a lighthearted comment can break the tension and remind family members that they care for one another despite the disagreement. However, humor should be used carefully, ensuring that it doesn't dismiss the seriousness of the conflict or hurt anyone's feelings. When used appropriately, it can bring perspective to a heated situation. Finally, resolving family conflicts requires patience and persistence. Not every issue will be solved immediately, and that's okay. The important thing is to remain committed to working through the problem even when it's difficult. Over time, with continued effort and a willingness to compromise, families can navigate conflicts and emerge stronger, with deeper understanding and respect for one another. In conclusion, managing family conflicts constructively is essential to maintaining a healthy and harmonious household. Through open communication, empathy, compromise, and patience, families can address disagreements in ways that strengthen their relationships. Conflict, when approached positively, can be an opportunity for growth and unity, leading to a more resilient and connected family.